Remember your magic the magic that you hold is so great, and yet you rarely get to see it yourself. That's part of the veil that you are not supposed to remember, your magic. Here it is starting to unfold a little bit more every day. Claim parts of this, use it and anchor it into your reality, so it will become part of your daily work. The magic is part of who you always were, for we cannot teach you how to be magical, dear ones. We can only help you remember that you are. You read books about all the beautiful, magical things that take place on your planet. They are real, dear ones, that is why you are so fascinated with them. To have powers beyond the physical energies alone and to see things in the future, those are done through the universal energy. You're all connected through the universal energies. Your magic is growing when humans are experiencing something very difficult, they often shut down and try to hide from the world. But everyone else can feel it, dear ones, so sometimes it is better just to own who you are and let yourself be felt. Sometimes it's better just to say, I am hurting. I am not okay, something is wrong. That's when you gather all the energy from other healers on planet Earth. And they are waiting to connect with you more than you can possibly know. Many of you are those healers waiting to jump into action to see the next level. The universal energy is becoming more important, because it will be felt in your world. You will feel vibrations coming through the universal energy. It's the same way that you hear things when they are spoken, and the same way you feel things. But most of the feelings now are blocked compared to what you're about to experience. You're actually returning to carry some of the attributes of home on your planet as you walk around in density, pretending to be separate from the whole. You are pretending to be separate from each other. You're magical beings and the magic is starting to grow. How do I use this? It's very simple, start sending energy out consciously. Most of the time your energy is about how you feel. In other words, if you're walking down the street and suddenly you become aware of something, you check into how your body is feeling. How is your stomach, your head? How are your legs feeling as you're walking down the street? It is common to be focused inside the Taurus, because that's where all your action has been. But in the near future, you will also be focusing outside the Taurus to see the effect that your energy has in the planet. Now, that is an incredible opportunity. In the beginning it will be misunderstood, and there will be those who try to use it incorrectly or selfishly. Of course, there are many bad actors on your planet. But the reality is, it doesn't make any difference. As you start using this, humans will learn how to put their best foot forward. A time of no more secrets they'll learn how to create the path in front of them before they step out the door. That's the highest potential of walking in the light, for you are magical beings, each and every one of you. And you are reaching a new level of magic with the universal energy. We also told you a while back that you are entering the time of no more secrets. Well, that time is already here and you can see it in many different ways. You see into other people's hearts. You will feel things that you haven't been able to before, for that is this harmonic level you're reaching. That is exactly what this process is about, so use it and play with it. Smile and know it opens the door to where you are going. It opens the possibilities for the highest potential, creating the path of least resistance right in front of you. You are magical beings, dear ones. You are the greatest angels that have ever lived. And here you are in place for the next miracle that is about to take place. We've told you many times that these magical things sort of happen behind the scenes. Most humans are not even aware of them, like when the timeline crossed or the recent Stargate opening. But that doesn't have as much to do with humans as it have to do with the Earth. The planet is changing very rapidly and trying to adjust, to be able to support all 8 billion spirits that are now there. Earth is trying to work with you in different ways and doing quite well with it, for she is getting help. There are great possibilities with Earth that were not there only a short time ago. We also tell you that all of your energies working with the Earth are amplified greatly during these times. If we had to use a number, we would say it's amplified almost 56 times. In other words, every piece of trash that you pick up is amplified 56 times. 
Every time you decide to walk somewhere instead of drive, that savings is amplified 56 times. And it works in both directions, because if you do something that has a harmful effect on the earth it is also amplified 56 times. But you have the ability to change all of that. Enjoy this journey, dear ones. Your energy is vibrating out into the universe and it is being felt by more beings than you ever thought possible. All eyes are on planet Earth during these times. And we have the perfect people in place, for there you are. Know that you are in the perfect place at the perfect time. You are claiming your magic more every day. It is with the greatest of honor that we ask you to treat each other with the highest respect. Open the doors for each other. Nurture one another and play well together, as you play these beautiful new games. We are magical ourselves, but nothing compared to your magic. It is our job to hold the mirror in front of you, only to help you remember who you truly are and why you came here. You're right on schedule, well done, dear ones. We are the group of nine.